Hey everybody, how's it going? Well, off the talk of reinstating the assault weapons ban, I thought today I'd get one of my assault weapons out and shoot it. And today we're going to shoot my reproduction 1847 Colt Walker. And I know some of you are saying, wait a minute, this is not an assault weapon. Back in 1847, this was the assault weapon. Prior to this, most of your rifles and pistols were single shots. There was one revolver out there on the market called the Colt Patterson. This is an upgrade of that revolver. Uh, Samuel Walker had some ideas on how to upgrade the Patterson and he got in contact with Samuel Colt and they came up with the Walker. The Patterson was a five shot 36 caliber and you had to actually break the pistol or the revolver down in order to load it then reassemble it. The Walker you don't have to do that. It's a six shot 44 caliber. All you have to do is pour your loose powder into the cylinder, drop your ball in there, and then you take this ramrod and you put, seat your ball and your powder down into the cylinder. And then you take your percussion caps and place them on the nipples. Yes, I said nipples, and this has six nipples. Once you did that, you're ready to rock and roll. Like I said, this was the assault weapon of its day. This was six shots of 44. Actually, this was the world's most powerful handgun for a very, very long time. Walker wanted uh, a re revolver that could hit a man or a horse at 100 yards and still bring him down, and this baby will do it. So we're going to fire off six rounds from the Colt Walker. I got a tree out there about 75 yards, 80 yards, and we're going to fire into that. All right, here we go. And she is loud. And we're empty. Whew. Boy, she's loud. Uh, one of the disadvantages of this revolver was if you saw that the loading rod pop down, it had a weak spring in there, and that actually happened with these original walkers. Uh, they upgraded this with a different loading gate that prevented it from doing that. But this is the assault weapon of 1847. Now you know, boys and girls. Man, that thing's loud. Whew.